the battle has ended. The Tyrus and the Dark Hour have disappeared. By an unexpected miracle, the world was saved from the fall. Peace was restored and people resumed their busy life. No one remembered anything but the extraordinary chance of event. And so, the season changed. One month, one month later. It's March. Yo! Damn, it's cold. But of course, you never miss a day of school. Man, can you believe this year's already over? We're practically seniors now. Just one more year. You think anything interesting will happen? Definitely. I hope you're right. But seeing the current seniors makes me wonder. Seems like all they freaking do is study. Talk about boring. Is that gonna be us next year? Why do I feel like I'm forgetting something? Hey, it, is that girl looking at us? Yeah, it's the same with the bad ending. Dude, she's pretty cute. How come I never noticed her before? What are you talking about? She lives in the same dorm as us. Seriously? Uh, what's her name then? I don't know. So then why are you giving me a hard time? Anyway, it's always crazy in the dorms this time of year. With so many people coming and going. Oh yeah, did you hear? Akihiko Senpai's moving out. You know, the captain of the boxing team. I know who he is, but I haven't really talked to him. Of course, all the graduates are leaving, even Kirijo Senpai. Miss Student Council President. She's in our dorm too, huh? Hey there! Are you looking at us? Is something wrong? Um... It's nothing. She looks kind of depressed, doesn't she? Wait, do you think she might be interested in one of us? Yeah, really? <laughs> I doubt it. Ouch, that hurts. By the way, Yukitan. Uh, never mind, forget it. Aw, oh, come on now. Don't give me that. Um, well... Do you remember how we became friends? I mean, don't take it the wrong way. I was just thinking. Well, it's not like we're best friends or anything, so I guess it just kinda happened. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. It is kind of weird, actually, now that I think about it. But I can't really explain why. Anyway, that girl. Oh crap! Crap, the bell ringings. class has ended for today. This is the epilogue, so we could talk to every single social link we make. And yeah, including uh, seeing around the city. Graduation is coming up, but it's a waste of time to pursue anyone who's leaving. Next year will be tough. Oh man, those hot chicks won't stay single for long. You better stop planning now. Yori. A lot of stuff happened this past year. I don't remember what exactly, but it was big. I know that, but if it was that big, shouldn't I remember it a little better? Oh man, it's making my head spin. I'm confusing myself. What the hell did we do this year?
brilliant solution. Would you like to know what politician is on the Bay Area? Not now. Okay, first, Kenji. Sub child? Jude, I've got a super important announcement to make. Wanna hear, huh? Okay, here goes, and this is just between you and me, okay? Next year, there are three fine looking woman teachers coming in. After Emmy, I mean, Miss Connolly, there's no spark to the faculty roster, right? Miss Toriumi has that weird secret she refused to tell anyone. Miss Onisi is obsessed with medicine. Mr. Rauchi is like going to India or somewhere. I mean, come on, even our nurse is a guy. Even if it's good at the job, nurses are supposed to be girls. Shooting my lifelong dream to fake sick, ditch class and chat with a hot nurse. You okay dude? You're not looking so good. You should see the nurse, but uh, I'm not going with you dude. Oh, 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 and I heard those new teachers are coming by today to check out the campus. I'm thinking about hanging around the faculty office to scope them out. Wanna come? Alright. Wise decision, oh Sir Chow. See? Starting next year, we can choose our home room. So we've gotta make sure we choose the right one, if you catch my drift. Wait a minute! Oh crap! Today not much tree, is it? <coughs> Shit! Sorry man, I gotta get lost before she gets here. Let's see. My, my little sis supposed to be coming here starting next year, but she's gonna swing by today and look around. But I'm not gonna be her damn tour guide. I don't want to lead her around by the hand where everyone can see. <sighs> I wish I had an older sister instead. Well, whatever. I'm just gonna jet land. I'm gonna jet later, so. Chao Kun. Sorry, I was just thinking about you. Hey. Um. Can we go somewhere else? Sure. Thanks. Are you okay, Chao Kun? You don't look so good. Sorry for calling you out here. Um, I actually have a little favor to ask. Well, the car eyes are cast down as if hesitating. It, it's my mom. I want you to meet her. Uh, hey, that's not what I meant. I just promised to visit my mom, but I'm still kind of scared. If I see her, I might end up saying some really nasty thing. What if we end up hurting each other even more? I don't want to hurt her feelings. I still haven't sorted all this out inside. I think I do want to see her. That's why I thought it'd be great if you could be there with me. You don't have to say anything, really. I feel more confident just by having you around. I feel like I can clear the air with my mom if you come with me. So, if it's not too much trouble, how about it? Sounds good to me. Really? Thanks. I call her up right away. I've been putting this off for so long. Sorry, my family is such a pain. Hey, so I bet you're thinking, couldn't I have gone out with someone with fewer problems? I want to go out with you. Hey, it sounds weird when you come right out and say it's like that. I was just joking. Jeez. It's almost spring break. Went by so fast throughout his senior. At the end of the year, we graduate and go to college, and then start a career. Wow, it's hard to imagine. Do you think we'll still be together then? Of course. Yeah, I think so too. Well, let's talk about the near future then. How about going somewhere over spring break? Oh, maybe we could go to Disney Destiny. Destiny Land? Yeah. But, but just the two of us, okay? You better not invite anyone else. Like, if we stay the night and stop. I wonder if anyone else at the dorms would realize if we would went away for the night. That's embarrassing though. So we'll talk more about it later. Don't forget to leave some time free during spring break. Okay, put us in the roof. It's Yuko. I'll decide to go 
a four-year college. I think it's true that you need a good education in life, but that doesn't mean I've given up. I'll get into the fashion industry, even I have to take a part-time job or something like that. Let's see who's in class. Oh, Kenji is gone now. New car also is gone. Everything is fine. Oh, ciao! I was looking for you. This came for you from Mamoru. I bet it's cool and sorry it's gone. But it's good news for us because now there's nothing standing between us and total victory. See you around. You received a letter from Amoru. You opened the letter. How are things, child? I never knew your address, so I'm sending this to your school. Mamoru's from handwriting fills the page. I'm doing good. I'm starting to get used to the job too. But what I really wanted to talk to you about was swim team. Before, I had totally given up on the idea of continuing swim team. But even so, part of me still didn't want to let it go. I had to do it. But swim team was my whole life. The pictures memories right smile. I guess the plant manager realized what's up. He's helping me out. We're gonna make a swim team. Well, I call it a team, but it's really just a few guys at the factory. We practice after work and sometimes on our days off. The other day, we did endurance swimming at Lake Biwa. We've even climbed Mount Hie. We don't have fancy equipment like before, so it's not as efficient. But I'm enjoying myself. Most of the guys are just in it for fun, and we don't do much serious training, but I guess it's a good handicap for me. How about you? You're still at it, right? I'm sure you're just gonna keep getting better and better. I'm almost as anxious for you to improve as I used to be about myself. It's a strange feeling. So hey, ciao. One day, you and I are gonna go at it again. This time it'll be my turn to be your rival and get things going. It feels nice having a goal. I can't believe I had forgotten what what that was like. Oh yeah, and my mom's getting better. She's in a sanatorium with fresh air and good doctors. My relatives and friends come by the house, so my brothers are well taken care of too. Everything's going great this day. I feel like I'm able to take care of the people who matters to me. It's really fulfilling. And it's thanks to you that it's all come together. So, thanks man. Can't wait to see you again. Ciao, you better be ready. Blair ends there. Okay, every time we're back to rooftop, Oh, uh, you cool? What the hell? Oh, hey Chao Kun, are you leaving now? Me too. At least, I want you. But I've got to go somewhere. I'll come with you. What? No, no way. Uh, well, no, I can't. I'm going to the public library. Honestly? I hardly ever read in the school library. We're studying sport medicine, so I really don't have time today. Sorry about that. But since we're here together, why don't we talk for a while? Wanna walk with me to the entrance at least? At least not to the rooftop. Oh, well, I'll be going now. Good luck to you. Uh, yeah, thanks. Remember what I told you before? About finding my dream? I never had anything like that until now, so I've been slacking off. 
Honestly, my grid sucks. It's tough to get them back up. That's why I need to try hard. I still want to go have fun with you. Cross my heart. I want to be with you. And I kind of wanted to feel you too. But I gotta be patient. That's what I keep telling myself. I want to take my dream into my own hands. And stand next to you with my head held tight. I want to walk alongside you. You just watch. I'll charm the pants off you. You fall in love with me all over again. Just kidding. See, I really need to be patient. Hey, you know that saying? Fear tastes better after an honest day's work, right? That is what I mean. If we're patient now and cool off for a while, then later on? Ah, oh, you idiot. Look what you're making me say. Uh, anyway, that's what I'm trying to say. I'll see you later. Let's go out again sometime soon. Okay. Uh, hold your horses. There's still a lot of girls. They need to talk about. To hero. Mr. Pierre. Oh, Chao san? Uh, are you okay? You don't look so good. You should get home and rest before you get worse. Right now, I um Oh sorry, you're feeling sick, and here I am making you stand around. What were you going to say? Chao san. Well, it isn't much, but Look at this flyer here. The history of patient love between teacher and student. People are free to fall in love with each other. There's nothing bad about it. I can see why it would be a problem with this what's between a teacher and student, but it doesn't give him it doesn't give them the right to make fun of it like this. I'm going to write a protest letter to school pepper. Oh, I'll be alright on my own. I'll go by myself. Chao san, thank you very much. I've made up my mind. It's not much, but next year, I want to join the student council too. The things that show me the way to change myself. It was in console. Uh, and you. I want you like myself more. And I want you to like me more too. I want to be the first one in your tone. That's why. Um I I like you. What am I saying? I I can't believe I said something like that at school. Uh, I I'm sorry. W well, please excuse me. But maybe next time we could go home together. Or if not there, I have a lot of place I like to see. I want to visit each of them with you. Okay, thanks you hero. Nice to hear from you. Still in console room? It's locked. Okay, sorry. So about you. You remember the weird stuff that happened about a month ago? It was near midnight and everyone was standing outside. I was outside too, but to tell you the truth, I don't remember anything about it. I think it's because I'm too worried about Mitsuru Senpai moving away to another country. What? Can we take a piece? Answer.
Ah, oh, feels great. Everybody's in average condition. Why?